Hello all. Uh, today we are going to check the Java program uh, which is having the logic to move all the zeros from the an array to the end or to move all the zeros to the beginning of an array. So we will check the program Java program to move all the zeros to the start of an array or to the or to the end of an array. Write a Java program to shift zeros in an array beginning and and shift to shift the zeros to the end. So problem description uh, given an array of integers shift all the zeros present in the beginning present to move push into the uh, end. So for the given input so one zero two three zero four we need to move all the zeros to the beginning means like our output will be 0 0 1 2 3 4 and uh, uh, another way is to move all the zeros at the end so our output should be 1 2 3 4 0 and 0 so problem solution will check so logic will be we need to traverse an array from beginning to the end whenever a zero is encountered we should move it into the position of the first non-zero element in the array. This is for to move zeros to the beginning of the an array and second uh, logic is to move zeros to the end of an array. For that we need to traverse the array from the beginning to end and whenever a non-zero is encountered move it into the position of the first element having zero value in the array. So we'll check for the java logic here so this is the problem statement and uh, what should be the solu uh, output should be there so we need to implement this code in java so i have already written a code for this and we need to debug this okay. yeah i will open the console so we can check the output also simultaneously uh, we we have taken an input having the array uh, 198400 uh, 270609 okay here we have the zeros in an array we should move either to the end or at the beginning means the uh, zero it should be either all the zeros at the starting of the uh, starting of an array or uh, at the end of an array we can use uh, we should not use any of the other data structure we can use uh, we can't use the sort method like we can't sort an array so that all the zeros will be in the beginning but it might affect the position so if i use arrays dot sort so 0 0 1 4 9 8 8 9 it will become so it will be cause the positioning of uh, element so we need to uh, avoid that one okay we have taken the input and we have taken the length in an a, n variable and we need to print the input array so we can get to know what is the original value so now we have written the first logic to move all the zeros to the end so we'll check for this logic what is the main logic for that so you are able to see uh, int temp so here we have the temp we have taken one and temp variable we have the parameters array and the length of an array so we have initialized j equal to 0 in for loop we need to as the algorithm says we need to traverse an array from beginning to end for int i is equal to 0 so i less than n i plus plus so if it is array of i uh, if it is not equal to zero means it is if it is non-zero then we should do the swapping logic so we can't use any other data structure but we can use the temporary variable so that we can use the swapping so a of i if it is non-zero then we should move so a of i is 1 it's in a non-zero element so we are doing the swapping so we need to store the a of i in temp variable so we need to 
replace the value with the a of j j is nothing but 1 okay now we can able to see we are moving the to all the zeros at the end so whenever we non zero detected we are moving to the beginning so j will start from zero so we have moved now okay we have done one replacement swapping so now we need to increment the j so that it should start from the second position so again if uh, i got the input so here one nine so now a of five will be of nine okay we should get the if it is non-zero then we should do again swapping so here five temporary we stored in nine and a of j is now as we see a of one it's nothing but nine so we, we need to do the swapping so until all the uh, zeros all the non zeros should be moved to the front and all only zeros should remaining so here what will happen if it is non zero only then it will do the swapping so values will be moved to the front so we can we are able to see the input array 19842 Okay, a of a seven. It is also non-zero. It will do the swapping for that. So now we got the non-zero zero element. So it didn't perform swapping. So now we got the zero. So he till here it process. So it will uh, go further. here zero only it is there so finally our array it moved all the non-zero item to the front and the zero elements to at the end of an array okay now we'll see the output in the console so after moving all the zeros end of array i have used array start to string so i can print all the element of an array in a single print statement instead of using for loop so 1984 this is the output here we are able to clearly see all the zeros are moved to the end of an array okay now we'll go for the logic push all zeros to the start so we have taken the input of the output of the uh, mode zero element so with that we can directly move all the zeros to the front we can take the direct input also so both the way it will work start index we need to as the logic says we need to loop all the elements from the uh, in order to to the beginning we need to traverse beginning to end whenever zero encountered move it to the position with the first non zero element okay now we have to check whether that is the in given input array is zero or not the main logic is here we are checking whether it is non zero or not here we for zero we need to do the swapping so if it is zero then it will go inside until we didn't got any zero so it will okay whenever a zero detected it will assign the j it will start from the loop j equal to i i is nothing but till where the work uh, uh, increment got uh, for the uh, increment uh, value it is there so if it is uh, i equal to a then it should be greater than start index start index is nothing but zero it will be there so till now we didn't did any swapping so that's why start index will be zero and we need to do j minus minus so here we are able to a of phi a of j nothing but zero and we need to replace with the array of j minus 1 it's 9 so now we got the logic so our element 9 it is here and 0 it is here now we should do the swapping so that swapping we should do from 8 to start index 0 so it will replace all the elements in such a way that swapping will be done from 
beginning to end we will just verify the zero see zero more till here now we are able to check the zeros position is mode here so it will move it's until it detects the starting index means as per the logic it will move all the first non-zero element until it detects position of the first non-zero element okay it will uh, loop until that so now it mode so start index got incremented so array of i if it is equal to zero so yeah it will go now start index is one and i to pull j the i position will be nine so it will swap from the beginning to end okay Now we have only one zero remaining. Okay. Now we got the array as the all the zeros moved to the front. So we need to print that output. So after moving all the zeros to the starting of an array, our output will be. Zero 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 one nine eight four two seven six nine. So, thank you all. I will share this program in uh, video description as well. So we'll meet in next video. Thank. You.